everywhere you look everywhere there's review reviews hey what's up everybody review man here and today i am reviewing episode number five of fuller house of 13 of the first season and i don't know if i covered this in my last full house fuller house video but they're doing a season two bring them back and this time michelle tanner is going to be in season two but anyway on this episode five of season one and today is the episode is called mad max not the mel gibson movie not the movie mad max fury road has nothing to do with any of that in this episode max he's trying to get build up and build up enough courage and stuff to play a, at a as a school recital and Stephanie gives him this magnet scarf but but, but before she can but Stephanie gives him the magic scarf and gives him the magic to play in front of anybody that he wants because the scarf is supposed to have magical powers which is pretty cool but anyway before Stephanie's um so this person comes to the house and Stephanie gets offered a job opportunity playing a DJ a DJ at a concert because she's a musical DJ and so. stuff. Anyway, yeah, she goes off with a magical scarf. Max is freaking out, saying, Hey, Stephanie went off with my scarf, and Stephanie, I can't play without my scarf. And everybody's giving them tips. Like, Jackson gives them tips to picture people in their underwear. And so, he does that with the dog by having the dog in some boxer shorts. It's a, it's a good episode. And so, yeah. Um, and while this is going on, Ramona is babysitting Tommy, and while she's doing her little vlog, she, um, she changes Tommy, flushes the diaper down the toilet, floods the toilet, and Kimmy sets up, put, sets up DJ on a dating website, and said, man, you need to get out there. And so the, the, one of, um, people that DJ got matched up with comes to the house Kenny brings him to the house and DJ thinks he's a he's the plumber but he's not so they t he says how you want to do this you want to go and everybody's totally confused the uh, DJ thinks that her dates the plumber um the date thinks that DJ is kind of messed up in the head and likes his role play stuff and then but they go they go in the bathroom and DJ he says you know fix the toilet and right he's like I'm not he's like you want me to be the naughty plumber and then here comes Kimmy in with the real plumber and yeah and so yeah that gets straightened out and Kimmy gets it is going goes on a date with a plumber and in this episode you find out Kimmy was hypnotized and she she gets hypnotized every time somebody says houseboat. She starts burp, 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 barking like a chicken. And whenever they say boxcar, Kimmy goes back to normal. It's crazy. That's a whole Kimmy Gibbler for you. And so what DJ Max does is like, Aunt Stephanie took my scarf. And at the time of the um, concert, at the time of the little recital, she, um, DJ calls um, Stephanie on FaceTime. And he's like, what is it? What? Hey, I'm really busy. And then he says, you took, um, Stephanie, you took, um, Mag Max's magic scarf. And he's like, what magic scarf? And he's like, the one you got on, on you. And he's like, oh, okay. And he said, wait a minute, guys. I got an idea. And so, what's going on? What went on is Stephanie and Max, they do a rendition of Old McDonald Had a Farm. And Max, he played in front of everybody at the concert to try to boost his try to boost his own confidence up that he had the ability to play to play the saxophone the entire time he didn't need the scar he had the ability the entire time which is pretty cool and that gave him the ability to play at the recital because he played in front of this whole crowd of people and he can also play at the recital through face time which is pretty cool and then next thing we see is old Ste uh, Stephanie come back to the house and DJ's in the room with Tommy. They get they get the 
they're in the room with Tommy, and Stephanie comes and tells DJ that she can't have children be because that's, yeah, she's not able to have kids. And that's why she's grown so attached to uh, uh, Ramona, Tommy, uh, Jackson, Max. And that's why she's going to grow attached to all of them. Because she's living through the, the kids, living through her kids. And DJ's like, you know what, Stephanie? We're sisters and my fam my kids are your kids. So, and we'll always be there for you. And then everybody gets, you know, Everybody gets in a big hug, and she said, Yeah, Stephanie's back, Stephanie's baby, Stephanie. And then Kimmy comes in whenever they're all hugging. She's like, I knew I felt a hug coming on. I knew I got a hug. And he's like, How did the date go with the plumber? Oh, he's good. He, he's good. He lived on a, a, what's the word, what's the word? And then Max says, Houseboat. Bark, 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 bark. And she, she goes on for like five or six seconds. Then everybody says, Boxcar, and, go, and goes back to normal. So yeah, anyway, this was a pretty good episode. Check it out if you aren't, haven't already seen it. If you have, have it, go check it out. I'm the Review Man. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good YouTube stuff. And I'm going to try to post at least another video today. But if not, I will see y'all guys tomorrow. Peace out. Peace.